Hey vlog buddies, so here I am in Palm Springs, California, and it's beautiful. I left crotch deep snow back home in Rhode Island, and it's like 82 degrees here. I went swimming today, and I have to say, I blame it on my Catholic upbringing, that I actually feel like a little bit guilty that I'm like cheating on winter or something, that it's just like, it's too nice here, and um, that I'm enjoying it. I'm really enjoying it. And the place that I'm staying at, it's called Indulge which is I-N-N-D-U-L-G-E, so it's kind of a play on words. I think it's really clever and cute. It's clothing optional. And so, though I enjoy being naked or shirtless or my underwear at home, the prospect of being naked in public is an entirely different beast. And it's a gay resort. So, not only is it nudity, it's gay nudity. And quite frankly, it's a lot. It's a lot to handle. I'm gonna save all that for my next talking vlog because we could go on for hours about that. But, so I'm in Palm Springs, and today I uh, I did like a, a, a whole tour of the area, and I took a lot of pictures, which I'll post at the end of this video so that you can check out. But probably the most amazing thing is that I picked my own fruit. Picked my own fruit. This does not happen in Rhode Island. This navel orange, apparently, was hanging on a tree. I literally picked it off a tree 30 minutes ago, and I'm gonna eat it. And. I have grapefruits. I've never seen a grapefruit this color, but it's a grapefruit. And then a Meyer lemon. Um, and avocados are 47 cents each in California. Amazing. So this is the grapefruit and it's actually, well, I don't really like grapefruits, but if I did, this one would be really good. And this is a Meyer lemon. Ooh, I don't think you're supposed to eat it like that. Ooh. So I think, <coughs> excuse me, <clears throat> take two. So I think the thing that's really interesting about when you fly into Palm Springs, we went across the Grand Canyon and I love how like everyone on the plane that has done this trip like a million times was so on phase. And I was like stuck to the glass. I was like, is that the Grand Canyon? I was like tapping the woman next to me. I'm like, that's the Grand Canyon. That's the Grand, and she's like, yeah, yeah, that's, that's, we're flying over the Grand Canyon. I'm like, I've never seen the Grand Canyon before. Oh my gosh, I was like so excited. And everyone was like super on phase. Um, but you're flying in and it's desert, 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 desert everywhere, just reddish orange desert. And then all of a sudden in the middle of the desert is like green grass, golf courses, ponds. And I had a little bit of an attitude that like, you know, well, it's probably not the best idea to be so water excessive in the middle of the desert. It doesn't make a lot of sense. And when that Colorado River runs out, y'all are going to be high and dry and those swimming pools are not gonna be looking so hot. But, as it turns out, apparently Palm Springs is on like 100 years worth of water aquifer, and that's why they call it Palm Springs, is because there's a spring that comes up underneath, and it's an oasis in the middle of the desert. So I think one of the things that's like super cool about Palm Springs is it has this really old, like Hollywood feel to it. It's like very like Frank Sinatra, the Rat Pack, James Dean, maybe, I don't know if he lived here, Bob Hope, I saw Bob Hope's house today up in the mountains. Well, he's dead, so it's not his house anymore, I guess, technically. The buildings are very, like, 1950s modern. Like, it's super, super cool architecture. And there's palm, palm trees everywhere, 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 palm trees. And I cannot help but smile and be happy when I see a palm tree. Now, I know what you're thinking. I do not like to base my happiness on things outside of myself, except for palm trees. They're the exception. I will base my happiness on the palm trees that I see outside my window because when I see them I smile and I think it's beautiful and I don't think I could ever get tired of looking at palm trees. Okay so you probably want to see some of my pictures of Palm Springs. Actually you probably don't but you know what I'm going to show you anyway. I'll just put a few of my favorites that you can take a look at and stay tuned for Thursday because on Thursday, what's today? Sunday? Okay on Thursday I'm going to upload my talkie vlog about the nakedness here at Indulge and my thoughts. So anyway, um, I hope you enjoy your virtual trip to Palm Springs. I of course love you and I will talk to you soon. Peace out.